Today, everybody, I have some incredible news regarding the Isle of Rima, or the updates that will be coming, subsequent updates to the Isle of Rima. And today, I'm focusing on a specific topic, and that is elder and baby dinosaurs, which were just announced in the game's Discord server, and the elder ones were announced in a development update that was published in January, or at the end of the month for the game. It was a January dev blog, and they, you know, shared all the elder models that they've been working on but anyways guys if you do enjoy this video and you enjoy videos like this feel free to like and subscribe i make a whole bunch of content on this channel from dinosaur games to dragon games and i try and cover as many up and coming dinosaur games as i can as well as existing dinosaur games also try and join my discord server i'm aiming for 500 members in the server so we can get partnered and every little helps but other than that let's get right into this brand new the isle of rima news video Firstly, we're going to be starting off with the Elder Models for the game. If you do not know what an Elder Model is, I'm pretty sure the Elder Model is literally the final form of a dinosaur. You know, when it's old and it's completely maxed itself out. I'm not actually entirely sure because personally, I haven't been playing the game for too long. So I wouldn't know what an Elder Model is. Actually, you know what? I'll leave this up to you. Guys in the comments, people who play the Isle a lot and... and you know, cover the game a lot. What is an Elder Model? Feel free to let me know. Educate me, you know, it's educate Veloci time. But yeah, I'll be covering these brand new Elder Models that were shown in the January dev blog, which you've probably all seen by now, but you know, I haven't been able to showcase them. I'm really, you know, they're really exciting, so I'm happy to showcase them to you guys who don't necessarily play the Isle and watch these videos. So, firstly, this list is absolutely brilliant. All of these Elder Models look so cool. Some of them go for extreme differences, and then some of them go for subtle differences, and I think it blends really well with the dinosaurs and everything, pretty much. So, anyways, of course, as I'm still fairly new, this really amazes me, but let's just dive right into it. So, firstly, we have the Ceratosaurus Elder Model, the Dinosuchus Elder, which does terrify me a lot. If Imagine that thing lunging out of the waterways to get you. I, I believe this one's a little bit bigger than the original uh, model for Dinosuchus, and it's, you know, it's got subtle differences, a bit chunky here as well. The Dilophosaurus Elder, now this is disappointing. I was expecting Dilo Dog to be the Elder for, you know, Dilophosaurus. Uh, you know, the devs missed the perfect opportunity for Dilo Dog. However, for the Trudon, we pretty much get Trudon Dog, which um, is, is interesting to me. The Dryo Elder has some very subtle differences from the original. It's a very nice alteration to the Dryosaurus in the game, and I can't wait to see this one and see how it actually looks compared to a textured, you know, fully skinned model back side to side with the Dryo. I really want to see what the differences are. The Tyrannosaurus Rex Elder looks absolutely badass, and I think this one will look absolutely incredible. It fits really well, and will definitely add some spice to Tyrannosaurus Rex in the game. Now, the Trudon Elder, I did say this is basically Trudon Dog, because, well, I don't think Trudon had that longer arms in the uh, in the game itself. Like, do you guys... Of course I'm new to the game. Is Trudon's arms that big originally in the game, or are they just even bigger now it's an Elder? Like, this one looks like Lapiraton, which is a very... Oh, I've probably definitely fucked that up, but I'll have it on the screen now. It reminds me of that, a very early non-dinosaur creature, which was in the Triassic. But yeah, this is basically Trudon Dog. Step aside, Dilo Dog. <laughs> Trudon Dog is in town, and I'm probably embarrassing myself because I don't know too much about the Trudon model in the game. But yeah, feel free to let me know. Is it is it sounds normally this big? Either way, I think it looks really cool. It's a very nice addition to the game. I never would have expected this from Trudon. Megarosaurus Elder looks absolutely badass. I think this one will fit very well. I love the back on this, the way it's armored. It fits with the model of Megarosaurus in the game. It's just more enhanced, more gritty, more, you know, it's gonna absolutely kill you. The Gallimimus Elder. I'm I'm pretty sure it's a galley. I don't know. I keep getting them confused between Path of Titans, Trufy, and the Isles. I'm pretty sure a galley. I'm not too sure. Uh, yeah, it's a very nice elder. It's very, um, it's subtle. Carnotaurus Elder terrifies me. It literally gives me Vietnam flashbacks because that thing is like, it's so terrifying. Being in a Vrima and hearing that thing bellow from the distance makes you shit yourself. The Hipsy Elder looks more terrifying to me than the OG Hipsy. This one actually looks like a grumpy old man who would offer you cookies that were laced in poison. The Overraptor Elder looks really neat and it ties in very nicely with the baby Overraptor. And finally, we have the Avaceratops Elder. Let me know which one was your favorite Elder out of all these Elder models. Let me know in the comments down below. <laughs> 
Right, anyways, now we're at the part that you've probably been waiting for. You know, you've probably skipped to this part in the video, and I've caught on. You know, I can't believe you skipping all the way to this part of the video. Gosh. If you haven't, you're a very good viewer, and I, uh, yeah, you, I like you, but if you have, I still like you. I mean, you're still watching, you, you could probably press quit right now and leave me, but please don't do that. I need the views. I've got babies to show you. Now, anyways, let's let's get uh, ahead of ourselves. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. These were shown yesterday. These baby dinosaurs were literally dropped yesterday for us all to see. And, of course, I'm covering them in today's video. They look absolutely adorable. So, let's just get straight into them. Because, like, oh, I want to look... Oh, they look so cute. I can literally pick them up and call them a good boy. Because they could probably fit in my arms and not be taller than me. Because most things are taller than me. First off, we have Minimi, which is even smaller. You know, it's an ever so Minimi version of Minmi. Yeah, my wordplay there was terrible. Ignore it, ignore it. I'm not a funny guy. <laughs> the Hipsy Juvie is also here. It's a very cute little Juvie but we all know Hipsy grows up to be the absolutely evilest thing in the world and I hate it. The big bastard. My Gyrosaurus Juvie, you know, it's very nice to see that it grows up to be the elder that my gyro look and it, it, this one looks adorable. You know, it looks like a baby elephant in a way. Bipasaurus looks adorable. It's, it's juvie looks adorable, which is literally, you know, since it's a baby danger floof, and it will grow up to probably the ugliest thing in the game. This thing literally looks like a, an angry goose. It looks like Dolan Dark. It looks like his profile picture, and it's terrifying. Geese terrify people, and this thing's definitely gonna terrify me. I'm not being fooled by this danger floof. You know, you may be a cute little baby when you're a baby, but when you're, you know, about knee height on me, you're probably gonna be scratching at my ankles with those teeth that are on your tongue, and it's gonna be terrifying. But finally, we have the Oviraptor, which looks absolutely adorable. Definitely one of my favorite babies out of the bunch. I love how the big eyes for babies, obviously babies normally have bigger eyes compared to their body. It's absolutely adorable and they look so cute. I just want to give them all a big, big hug. You know, the baby Bape looks like a naked owl, but the baby Ovi looks so cute. I, 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 I want that one. It's the one I want as a pet. Never to grow any taller. It's the baby Oviraptor. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Feel free to let me know what you think about it down in the comments below. It's been a good one. I really wanted to keep get this update for you guys. I wanted to cover the whole dev vlog, but I'm, I'm being restricted with uni work, which is due on Sunday. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you all in the next one. Have a great day. Peace.